everyone this is me rabab zehra from techx media i have as a guest with me today mr vishal gupta who is ceo of seclor today we will get to know more from vishal about how data centric security became the only option for data protection so before moving forward let's welcome vishal on techx media hi vishal how are you thanks a lot i'm i'm fine thanks a lot for having me it's it's a pleasure to have you here with me today so uh, vishal um uh, with uh, a lot of data being created every day uh, what do you think in, in like i have gone through your previous interviews and different conversations uh, you have talked about the ineffectiveness of enterprises trying to protect infrastructure uh, why do you think uh, that is the case um it's a great question see in my opinion um enterprises trying to protect enterprise infrastructure like devices applications networks and so on is a surrogate method of protecting the real asset which is data uh, and the enterprises don't really need to protect their network or the applications or the devices because mm -hmm. in most of these cases these uh, infrastructure elements don't even belong to the enterprise networks today are all public most people are working from home or working from anywhere uh applications are increasingly moving towards the cloud uh devices are becoming personal as more and more people work from mobile phones uh ipads and and uh, other personal computers and so on and even people uh, are becoming external which means that a lot of work is be a lot of data is being shared with external agencies third parties for outsourcing and and so on so uh trying to protect infrastructure elements that don't even belong to the enterprise uh is in my opinion an impossible to do exercise and therefore uh, most enterprise infrastructure protection initiatives don't achieve the real goal of protecting data that's uh, that's great and um, i think that all makes sense so now what is the option available uh, to enterprises today So the option is very easy if the real asset that an enterprise wants to protect is data then the enterprise should just do that which is protect data and and a lot of times enterprises and uh, enterprise security professionals get an impression that by protecting infrastructure they, they are protecting data which is not the case because data is going across all networks all devices all applications all people and so on and therefore coming up and deploying technologies which make security and privacy travel with the data wherever it goes is really the only option for enterprises so turn all the infrastructure security on its head and make all security very very data centric that's that's interesting so uh, moving forward uh, vishal uh, can you uh, simplify it for our audience in in simple words can you explain what exactly is data centric security a uh, data centric security is almost like a is a posture change mm -hmm. it's a new way of thinking more than anything else and then finally when it comes to implementation it it has a bunch of technologies which come under that hood the new method of thinking is that the only thing that an enterprise wants to protect is data and as long as data is protected uh, an enterprise doesn't and shouldn't care about uh, infrastructure now under data centric security as i mean once you get past that at the concept level there are various underlying technologies there are technologies which will go and discover data wherever it is because data itself might be lying in um end point devices laptop mobile phones file servers cloud applications third parties and so on right so there are so there are discovery technologies there are classification so once you've discovered the data now you need to classify uh you know what is confidential data what's not so confidential and so on and then once this build up is done you actually need to start protecting it right so there there are data protection encryption rights management kind of technologies and then there are data centric auditing platforms so these are systems which will track that data wherever it goes right now combination of all of this forms the general data centric security uh space even though Uh, i have laid it out as a sequential like right? you discover you classify you protect and and uh, and then you track it's really not that uh, sequential so a lot of enterprises for example 
want to start and do start effectively with protection so for example if an enterprise already knows that all my intellectual property and and designs are in this particular application or in this particular business unit then there is no need for discovery because you can just go and protect that data right uh sometimes there is a need for discovery sometimes there is a need for classification there is always a need for protection and always a need for data centric audits that so that class of technologies all put together is is data centric security right that's that's correct so as you um, uh, rightly mentioned that um, uh uh individual data centric security uh, technologies like encryption classification discovery etc have been around for years now so what is new what is new in this space i think what is new are these data centric security platforms mm-hmm. uh you rightly said that uh, discovery technologies classification mm-hmm. technologies encryption and rights management systems and so on they these have been around for many decades now yeah but what is new is that number one enterprises are running out of options on how to protect data right so the demand for these kind of systems has grown up on the supply side integration platforms which will integrate the discovery system with the classification system with the protection system whether it's encryption or rights management with the data centric auditing and tracking and compliance reporting systems there are these underlying platforms which will then allow enterprises to take the best of breed technologies in each of these spaces and build their own uh, tech stack whatever is most relevant and best for the enterprise so i think that and these uh, data centric security platforms also automate a lot of tasks so for example if an if a piece of data is discovered it can automatically be classified if it is classified it can automatically be protected and tracked and so on right so there's a lot of automation capabilities that are available in these platforms that's that's great uh, so another question i have is now uh, what do you see as the biggest challenge that enterprises face currently while uh, moving their posture to data centric security i think the biggest challenge here is to uh, it's a mindset and education mm-hmm. challenge which is that enterprises and security professionals are too used to thinking of devices applications networks and so on and not used to thinking of data as the real asset right so there's there's one i guess the biggest challenge is just at the concept level itself uh, after that uh, the data centric security either the lack of data centric security platform like just trying to deploy individual for example the dlp technology and a classification technology separately right causes chaos yeah uh so these integration platforms and their automation capabilities mm-hmm. therefore become very valuable but in the absence of this automation and just trying to run a bunch of individual initiatives within the enterprise has been has uh, been proven to be the the biggest challenge for enterprises that's that's interesting so a last question um as a ceo of seclore tell us that what seclore is doing in this space uh, seclore has been the leader in the rights management space historically and for the last couple of years all our energies have been redirected towards uh bringing developing and then 3 years ago we launched the most automated data centric security platform for large enterprises mm-hmm. right so our focus has has been historically and continues to be mid to large size enterprises for whom the data center, i'm not saying that this the data protection requirements are not there for small enterprises our focus is mid to large size and for mid to large size enterprises automation is the only way to go if you have a 10000 people bank or a or a 100000 people manufacturing organization for each person to be aware of classification of a document or a type of document is virtually impossible and therefore seclore uh, has been has been investing almost all its r&d efforts in automa- in the automation platform in the middle east and north africa uh, in in the middle east and africa uh, region uh, some of the largest enterprises use our technology to protect their most confidential data so these include companies like saudi telecom for example um qatar islamic bank for example and, and numerous banks financial services companies uh government agencies uh, you know across the middle east mm-hmm. uh, all of these enterprises use 
uh, secure to protect their most confidential data and and then once this data is protected now they don't care whether that go- that data is going to for example the office 365 cloud mm-hmm. or it's going to a third party and so on. Mm-hmm. outside of this region the the middle east uh, region secular has been and continues to be the leader in the data centric security platform space mm-hmm. some of the largest mm-hmm. enterprises in the world for example american express or applied materials or uh, uh, or uh, gm for example all of these companies use secular to protect their most confidential piece of data and we have 2000 enterprises who we are helping and growing rapidly that's that's so yeah we be, we've been the pioneers in the space and we continue to maintain that that's that's very very interesting and it was a very valuable information that you have shared with our viewers and i hope they have enjoyed listening to your views on data centric security thank you thanks a lot for having me again yeah thank you so much for your time and we hope to have you again with techx in future thank you Right. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned to TechX to know more about what is happening inside the technology industry. Goodbye.